Hello ladies and gentlemen. So last video I played GeoGuessr together with Frida and I really enjoyed the game. It was a lot of fun and the comments on that video were pretty positive. So I'm gonna play it again. It's just a lot of fun and um, I'm gonna see if I can beat my previous score. So in the last video we played two rounds. The first round I got 9913 points. The second round we played, we got 14,876 points. So let's see if we can beat that today. Um, I'm playing the entire world with a 10 minute round limit. Uh, of course, I'm gonna ta not take all that time, but I just wanna, you know, be able to look around. So let's get this started, right? Okay, I wonder where our first location is gonna be. Ooh, this is, hmm, in the middle of nowhere. This could be anywhere. There's a yellow line in the center, which kind of gives me America vibes, but there's no way to know that. Let's see if we can go in front of this person's driveway. Getting even more American vibes from this building here. Um, let's go. Oh, what does this this sign say? Entering Saint Clair County. Hmm, Saint Clair County. So that must definitely be America. But I have no idea. There are so many counties in America. Uh, but this looks very Central America to me, so I'm just gonna go here in the corner of Nebraska and hope it works. Okay, let's guess. That was a really good guess! That's 2,663 points, uh, only 940 kilometers away. So I picked Nebraska. And it was in Missouri, so it was pretty much Central America. I was correct on that one. All right, next round. Let's hope we get a little bit better clues this time. Okay, Asian feeling or maybe South Europe. We've got white license plates. Uh, so it could be, I don't, I don't want to speak my mind too soon. Let's see what those signs say over there. Uh, Electroniske Kompetente. Could be France. Hmm. Yeah, it's definitely somewhere in Europe. Let's see if we can get some more street signs somewhere. Uh, can we check on the sun? The sun is in the south, so we are in the northern hemisphere. Uh, Oh, look at those texts. I think that's... I might, this might be Poland or something. Yeah. Like, it must be Poland, Belarus, Ukraine, Czech... I th I'm thinking somewhere Poland, Czechia, and it looks quite warm. Um, so I'm thinking a little bit more southern. I'm going to go around here. Serbia. Okay, so that's Serbian text then. I had no idea. I, I, I'm not that good in uh, non-Arabic alphabetical stuff. Yeah. Anyway, 3000 points for 731 kilometers. Um, all right, let's go to the next round. All right, so we have a street sign over, oh, went past it. Street sign over here that says speed humps ahead, which again to me says Canada or America. A double yellow line in the center, again, that screams America to me. Uh, they drive on the right side of the road, so it's not Australia. Let's see if we can find out something here on this intersection. 
we've got some road names, but it doesn't help unless we know where we are. Supermarket San Miguel. So that makes me... Th I mean, that's the name of a cafe, but that does think make me think South... Southern America. Um, pharmacy... Yeah, this is definitely America and not Canada. I hope I won't be eating those words. <laughs> um, Let's see, there's some bigger city stuff over here. A Thai restaurant. Hmm. Lots of signs over there. Did this sign say anything? Oh, past it. Um, super dollar laundromat. Halal. Hunan village. Well, that doesn't tell me anything. That's just a halal supermarket, I guess. Ooh, what does it say on the... Is that Nevada? Neva no? I'm not sure. Like the bottom, the text here on the bottom of the car, I thought it might have told me what state it is in, but it doesn't. It's hard to see license plates. They're all blurred. Would have been nice to get in the license plates because in America all the license plates tell you what state they're from. But yeah, okay. I'm gonna look around a little bit more. I know I've been looking for two and a half minutes on this one already, but I just want some more clues. Ooh, okay, so this says Alexandria, v yeah. Something with Alexandria. I don't know where Excel Alexandria is in America. Is Alexandria a little... Oh, no, that's Europe. Hey. Um, I think Alexandria is... That's Chicago, Toronto. I don't know. <sighs> hmm. Difficult, difficult. I'm just going to go to that other intersection and hope for some more traffic signs or something. School buses. There's nothing on the school bus telling me. Fairfax County. Fairfax. It's a, it's a popular county. I've heard of Fairfax quite a bit. But I don't know where it is. So we're in Fairfax County. Uh, oh, we changed to a different quality camera car. That's sad. It's a little bit more blurry car. Ooh, does that bus say anything? Ah, they blurred the text on the bus and now the bus is gone too. Yeah, it's over there. I can't tell anymore. Well... Uh, it's just gonna give us some more streets names over here. Glen Road, uh, Leesburg Pike. Yeah, I wish I know where Fairfax was. Not getting... Like, there's a yellow license plate over there. Yellow is usually New York. So, you know what? Uh, and all the other ones are white, but it has a visitor from New York. This, so I'm gonna guess close to New York. But not really New York itself. So New York is in New Jersey here. So how about somewhere in Pennsylvania, center Pennsylvania? We'll try that. Okay, Washington here. So Washington, the city, has Fairfax over here. So that's good to know for the future. But I, I knew it was close to New York, so not bad. Uh, two th 200 kilometers away, 240 kilometers away, and 4,000 points. Not bad. Let's go to the fourth round. All right. Uh, middle of the countryside. Um, I've In France, I've seen countryside like this. Uh, but, you know, we could have this almost anywhere. 
Um, yeah, seems like in that direction there's almost nothing. We can do a couple of steps in this direction. There's a parked car over there. But we can't really get an angle on the license plate. White license plate and a European Golf. A European gar car, it's a Volkswagen Golf or Polo. Let's let's continue along the road, see if we get to see a little bit more. This looks way warm to me, like see the dry soil? So if it's anywhere in France, it must be very southern France. This little building here. Uh, the sun is in the south, so yeah, we are in the northern hemisphere. Uh, there's a little bit more stuff here in the distance. More cars. That's uh, either a vineyard or some kind of orchard. I just want to go get to this distant stuff over there and then I'll make my guess because I'm not going to get too much information. Why is it going so such small steps? Come on, get closer already. All right. That's 1.8 kilometers, so they use kilometers, which is a good sign for France. Uh, and again, some kind of bridge. Okay, we've got... People working from a pickup truck. <laughs> Look at all the stuff, they, they've got a chainsaw. Chainsaws with them, bottles of water, some oil, <laughs> curious people. <laughs> That's funny. <clears throat> Still can't see the license plate very well though. It is white, a white license plate, but the, the truck over there has got a yellow license plate. So, could be anywhere still. Oh, look. Excessi Podarali. Might this be... Yeah, maybe it's Italy instead. Okay, we're going somewhere... Um, because we see so many mountains and hills. We're going with Italy, but like around here-ish. I guess the correct country, but the, cr the wrong side of the country. So I'm still quite happy with that, but 763 kilometers could have been much better. All right, final round. All right, so beautiful, very tropical looking. Um, that city makes me think, like, there's lots of mountains and a city over there. Water over there, but it looks more lake than uh, ocean. Palm trees. So definitely a warm location. Um, let's do a step in this direction. Look at the cars a bit. The, gar the cars make me think it's not America, at least. Um... Still could be, this is an American car there too. Well, yeah, maybe it's still America though. But all the palm trees and the mountains, like palm trees usually is California or um, uh, what's the other one called, Florida. But since I don't see ocean and mountains instead, that makes me think we might be somewhere in Nevada. Um, oh no, there's definitely ocean over there. See that? Yeah. Okay, so ocean. Um, now I need to figure out if we can see if it's Nev uh, California or Florida. But how do we do that? Uh, let's see. Let's go towards the ocean a little bit. <laughs> uh, 
Does this intersection have any clues? Pilo, uh, Pilicoa Street. Hmm. It's very interesting. This is still close to the city, but these houses look a little bit dilapidated, some of them. Like they're both nice, but also not so nice. Which, you know, could be, could be Florida. Yeah, um, I can click around for the full, I've got seven minutes left and I can click around a lot if I just wanted to and find, uh, find more information, but I don't want to waste your guys' time. And I have myself been in California and this doesn't look like anything I've seen in California. So we're going with Florida. Uh, we're go we need to go close to the ocean. We saw earlier that the ocean had a little bit of a bay. Now this side of California doesn't have any bays, but the bays are all on this side. So how about we go somewhere around Tampa over there? <laughs> and it was Hawaii. Well, Hawaii is America, but the farthest away from America that you can be while still being in America. Oh, that was a bad guess. <laughs> Only 32 points for that one, 7,500 kilometers away. Well, yeah, the game fooled me there. Okay, let's see what our total amount of points is. 13,014 points, which puts us in the middle of our last two games. Uh, that wasn't, uh, that wasn't that good. That wasn't that good. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Um, it's a fun game. And if we look at the breakdown here, you can see, except for the Hawaii, Florida thing, we are usually in the correct continent. And uh, three, three out of the five times we were also in the correct country. But anyway, 13,014 13, points. See if you guys can beat it. Post your scores in the, com in the comments for this time. And uh, we'll see you all next video. Bye. So don't miss a video, subscribe now and I'll see you in the next episode.